Wow, I haven't played this game since middle school, I don't think. <coughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Alrighty. Oh shit. Why does it spawn me right under it? Did what? Ah, childhood memories. This was actually the first Call of Duty I ever owned. It wasn't the first Call of Duty I played. I played COD 4 and like COD 3 and stuff like that at my friend's house, but this was the first Call of Duty that I actually owned. I got it for Christmas one year when I was in 6th or 7th grade, I can't remember. And I remember just getting butt fucked on the multiplayer, so all I did was spec ops in the campaign. I remember loving the Call of Duty campaign though. It wasn't until Ghost, I think Ghost was the first- oh okay, they got a nuke, that's fucking fantastic. <laughs> But I think Call of Duty Ghost was the first Call of Duty I actually played the multiplayer before the campaign. Like, before that, I was all, like, about the campaign and I didn't really care about multiplayer. It's weird knowing this game is, like, almost six years old. What? Like, five, six years old. Doesn't seem like it's been that long. MW3 was, like, the first Call of Duty that I actually got at a midnight release. If You, you can see the posters all behind me. And that MW3 poster was the first uh, poster I ever got at a midnight release. All those posters behind me are midnight release posters, I think. I just looked at my face cam and you can't even see the posters behind me, great. <laughs> but MW3 was the first Call of Duty I ever got at a midnight release. It was my freshman year of high school, I remember, and I remember going with my mom or whatever. And then Ghost was the first Call of Duty I actually got by myself, that was my junior year. And I had just turned 17 because my birthday's in November, and my birthday's usually either the day Call of Duty comes out or like right before the yearly Call of Duty comes out. And I remember being so excited to be able to buy my first rated M game without my mom <laughs> when I turned 17. I went to GameStop and like put the game on the counter and I was like yeah this is what I want they were like okay can we see some ID please I was like ha, 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 yes you can pull out my wallet and then it got really awkward when I didn't have my ID on me about to quick scope someone <clears throat> I'm sorry if I don't sound super motivated or anything like that right now guys oh, what the fuck I am a little tired because I took one of those like super long naps where it's like you take a nap in like the middle of the day and then you wake up in the middle of the night and you're like no what year is it literally i woke up like just a few hours ago it's like 5 a.m right now <sighs> my sleep schedule is just still fucked it just nothing is working honestly i think it's pretty much impossible to fix your sleep schedule it just it, it won't work the only way possible to fix your sleep schedule if there's like something you need to do or like something that is absolutely necessary for you to do to make you want to go to sleep at a certain time and then wake up at a certain time to fix your sleep schedule otherwise you're just fucked Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, that guy got fucked up. Should I try to fucking pull a YOLO? Oh. <laughs> oh, I dong that guy. How do I get- What? That guy just hit a quad, what the fuck? He hit a multi, what? I'm done.